there has to be some nagging problem that's, uh, that's driving that person to spend and invest the time to figure this out. So it, how that product manager manifests a product insight into a solution is a function of building a company. Every startup is effectively a hypothesis, right? That's going to get proven or disproven. And the market has all the answers, and it's going to tell you whether it works or it doesn't work. So the process of the product insight is laying out what you believe is a hypothesis that's going to be true, but you might be proven false. If the hypothesis is underpinning a startup, the startup is just a process to prove something in a, effectively an experiment that you believe in. And it takes a lot of motivation and energy to you know, put your life on hold to go try to solve this problem. It's the reason why you shouldn't start a company for financial motivation. That's really the byproduct of having created value and built something. So I think it gets back to the motivation behind the people and are they willing to focus on coming up with that insight, especially in a B2C company? And then do they have the resources, capabilities, team, and everything else to surround that hypothesis with, to then go execute to find out if that hypothesis is valid or not? If I'm hiring a, a product head, I'm looking for a few things. I'm looking for the art and the science. The art is this undescribable obsession bordering on unhealthy, <laughs> but not unhealthy, where the person is compelled to solve this problem.